Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. In this video, we'll, we're going to be discussing how you can use social media platforms like Instagram and Facebook to reach candidates you might otherwise not be reaching, helping you then in turn find an attractive top talent for your open positions within your nursing home. Did you know that on any given day, only 20% of job candidates are actively looking for a new job, while 73% are passive? meaning they're not actively searching for a new job, but could be open to new opportunities if they were to arise. This means that if you're only relying on traditional job boards and websites where people tend to end up when they're actively looking for a job, you're missing out on a huge pool of potential candidates. Basically, for every 100 candidates you could possibly be reaching, you're only reaching 27 of them. So how can you target these elusive passive candidates? Well, one effective way is to use social media platforms to engage with potential candidates, showcase your employer brand and promote your job openings while they're passive. By doing this, you can attract the attention of passive candidates who may not be actively looking for a new job, but like I said earlier, would be interested in hearing about new opportunities. Now, when it comes to social media recruitment, it's important to focus on the platforms that are going to give you the best return on your investment. This means identifying the platforms that are most effective for reaching and engaging with your target audience. Now, presently, Facebook and Instagram are probably the best platforms that you can use when it comes to communicating and getting the attention of passive candidates in your recruitment efforts. Now, to make the most out of social media recruitment, you know, there's several best practices that you should be looking to follow. And these include things like building a strong employer brand to begin with, you know, by showcasing your company's culture, values, and employee experiences through social media posts, you can attract the attention of these potential candidates. Now, it's important that you're consistently posting relevant quality information that passive candidates are going to want to engage with. Now, once you do have that strong employer brand set up, it's start time to start taking advantage of social media ads and targeting ads. Social media platforms offer powerful ad targeting tools that allow you to reach very specific audiences based on job title, interests, and so much more. Through your consistent posting of relevant quality information and your use of targeted ads, now the next step is to make sure that you're actually engaging with these passive candidates making sure you're responding to their comments and answering their questions. And by engaging with them on social media, you're going to build relationships with them and turn them into potential candidates and potential employees in the future. Now, finally, encouraging your current employees to share your job openings and information about your company on their social media platforms is gonna widen your audience hugely. So there you have it. Social media recruitment can be a powerful tool for finding and attracting top talent for your organization or your nursing home. By following the best practices and choosing the right platforms, you can engage with both active and passive candidates and build that strong pipeline of candidates for your nursing home. But where do you start and how do you compete with the big players who have their own marketing departments and huge budgets to spend on social media recruitment? Well, it may seem daunting, this is where basically Recmark comes in. By partnering with Recmark, it's like getting your own internal marketing team with a completely done for you service to achieve your desired recruitment results. Listen, thank you so much for watching and best of luck with your recruitment, with your social media recruitment efforts.